Damn, this guy's dually so sexy. Give me two years, I'm gonna get me a personal dually. Get them wide tires on that boy. I need it, I want it, gotta have it. What's going on guys? Hot shot with me here. Your boy is back on his bully. Check your boy out. It's a Friday. We're ready to hit the road, man. Grab this little, go through the weekend, do a nice little test drive. Everything should be uh everything should be squared away. We got new leaf springs, we got new uh, motor number three in this truck, and then we got some wiring buttoned up, power inverter buttoned up, everything just been buttoned up, new shocks, new suspension. Uh so the truck is truck should be good to go. We gotta screw down some boards, but you know, I can do that uh I can do that this weekend. But anyway. Everything's all good, man. I just wanted to call at you guys. Go ahead and check in and uh, to let you guys know your boy is back. I'm officially back. I say, matter of fact, let's make this season three. This is officially season three of Hot Shot with me. It is uh, it's almost the end of summer. We're about to enter the fall. And let's see what the Hot Shot uh, OTR life got going for the boy. But anyway, Hot Shot with me, y'all. Y'all take it easy. Stay tuned. Peace. All right, what's going on, guys? Hot Shot with me here. It's Monday morning, dropping off the first load since we got the truck back. Check it out, it's back there, we're getting that fuel. I'm starting to love these two day runs. I'm switching up my strategy, especially that these rates are a little bit trash. So instead of trying to take more like one day loads, because you, you normally like, you can, you can probably get like some loads that pay a little bit better uh, on like 700 mile runs sometimes. It, it just depends, I'm not even gonna speak like that. But at the end of the day, with the rates being towards the, you know, lower two fives, twos of the, uh, on the low board, what I'm deciding to do is I'm trying to make less, uh, less deadhead. So to decrease my deadhead, I'm just having to take longer routes, you know, that take me throughout my days. Um, that way I can, you know, basically save a little bit more. So you definitely want to switch up your strategy if you can, uh, especially with these lower rates and everything being like how it is. Um, I don't know if you guys are seeing the rates starting to rise a little bit, but I'm not. Um, even though I've been, I have been off for like a month and a half, it's still kind of trash where I'm sitting on the low board. But we'll see what this week brings. All right, what's going on, guys? Hot shot with me here. I'm a little loaded later than uh, I wanted to be. It's noon, uh, about one o'clock. Hit and head to, uh, what's it called? Michigan with the load, man. Check your boy out. A little tall, babies. Not too bad. Like six feet tall, I want to say. It's not It's not horrible, so I shouldn't get like terrible MPGs. It's definitely the tallest I want to go, but I mean, we, we loaded and secured, man. We're ready to go. And uh, hopefully I can find something going towards the house by Friday. And, uh, which I should be able to. That way I can just, you know, spend some time with the fam for a weekend. And this is the way I'm gonna run it, man. This is the way I'm really gonna try to run my weeks. It's a lot more ease of pace. I mean, I'm chilling for the next two days. I really won't have to do any work aside from book a load between now and Wednesday. So, uh, let's go sailing. It's one o'clock. Let's get it. I show me out. Peace. All right, and one more thing before I bounce. Uh, these are kids. They're all bolted down. Um, it's a little sketchy. I definitely got this little oversecured, but as we all know, oversecured does not exist in Hotshot World. I can't never be too careful. Do is I normally just do the ballot um, with the proper amount of straps, and even though they're bolted down and stuff is fragile, just put some two-inch straps, especially this one on the back, because it's gonna be bouncing up and down. Put the two-inch straps across the top, and just don't tighten them down too tight. I mean, you should be able to just tighten them down with one hand, not do two two hands action or you know pushing up with your legs or anything like that. That little boy is secured. I mean, I'll chain. And uh, everything else is ready to go. Check this out. You also want to look for little stuff that you see. I don't know where this came from, but I'm definitely going to keep it with me just in case and tell them that it fell off. And I also have the video recording to let them know that this happened before I left the show. But anyway, I shot with me, y'all. Y'all take it easy. The next day. Good morning, good morning, good morning, man. It's, uh, it's showing signs of fall right now. It's, uh, what, 4 o'clock in the morning right now. We up in Illinois, close to Chicago, the Windy City. Uh, getting ready to drop off this load about four hours away. Uh, that's why I'm also early. Awesome. But yeah, we're going ahead and dropping off this load. I feel like I've had this load forever, but after this, I'm going to pick up a boat. I hate that they, be, they always specialize in some stuff that you need to get in order to secure it. They should already have that stuff. I they want me to go get some J-hook straps. I don't have those on hand. I actually have some at the house, but uh, I, I normally don't recommend them because I never need them. But now I need them. And uh, I gotta go by Home Depot and grab those uh, today so that I can look up this boat. And uh, this boat's gonna take me home, man. It's uh, Labor Day, probably gonna be Labor Day weekend. And uh, I'm just trying to get home. Excuse me, I'm just trying to get home. Ooh, excuse me. 
because I keep forgetting that, you know, nobody's booking loads on Monday, uh, especially like 4th of July weekend, Memorial Day weekend, all that stuff was going on on Monday and stuff, so, or they always had that Monday off, so I keep forgetting that, so now I'm just trying to trade it home, go ahead and get home, but anyway, I'm going to get to it, on a little free trip, all the day, y'all take it is, uh, please stay tuned. And just like that, we finally made it, guys, we made it to the Check Your Boy out. It was a little dirty, but you can see mud all in my tires. But shout out to the for it. The boys give me right right now. All dirt. That's why a lot of times I will not wash my truck, especially when I know I'm going to a construction site, even though it's been sunny the last two days. I'm uh I'm getting a boat and then I'm headed home and I heard the weather's pretty good, so I'm getting the truck washed in. This is exactly why I love hot shopping right here. The most random stuff we're picking up a boat. But um yeah, they told me to go ahead and park right here. They're gonna get me loaded. Uh, I picked up the J straps that they ordered that they had asked. You know, I just ran by home depot real quick, got six of them. And uh, these only weigh about three thousand pounds, so it should be easy. They load to the ground as you can see, and uh, we'll be able to take this all the way to North Carolina. I believe that's me right there. I don't know if you guys can see my boat. Let's see if it turns around. me. Go outside and pay attention. Straight up dopeness. about having extra straps on you and thankfully I did add a two extra four inch straps on me because this was compromised this is a no-go so I went ahead and uh, switched it out I normally don't use this one that's why uh, I've been avoiding it but now that they were actually needed that strap uh, I went ahead and switched it out with the with the new one and we're gonna toss this well we're not gonna toss this you can actually use these as edge protectors and just cut it up as you go throughout the road you just never know what type of load you have so I actually always keep them um, you never know maybe you might need this shoot man they also out here doing the work for me all out there. They do all the work themselves. Shoot, all I literally had to do was just pull up. Just get, just pull up, provide the little J straps. I went to Home Depot and got, and uh, I said got copped all in one. But anyway, um, pull up there, grab the stuff that they need, and then they come. I think you're coming around to see me. Anyway. It's all good, they're doing the work though. But anyway, looks like all I gotta do is drive now. Y'all take it easy, have a great weekend, peace.